you've had a career, you've raised a family, um, done all these, been through all these milestones of just manhood or personhood. So what, do you have any just general advice you'd give to maybe young men in particular of uh, things that, hey, look out for this, this is a try this, don't try that? Be less impulsive and more um, kind of forward thinking about how your actions might actually impact your, you and others before you pull the trigger and decide to do something. I mean, yeah, maybe, a... you know, just give it some more thought. Give it a second thought before jumping in. Yeah, there's a Leonard Cohen song called Slow where he says, uh, I've never... I've always liked it slow. I've never liked it fast. You want to get there now. I want to get there last. And there's something he says about, uh, for you, it's got to go. For me, it's got to last. Mm -hmm. And that's always stuck with me of, you know, it's uh, doing things that it's always been important to me for, to do things that are meaningful and that I've thought through. And even I heard a, in a really good podcast the other day about how um, you're, say you're, how your house operates, like you and your spouse and who does the dishes and who does this chore. Like we think of those things as micro things, but those are the things that you're doing both house tasks and relational tasks that you're doing every day yeah. for your whole life. And so those are really the macro things. And if you just think about, okay, how do we set this up and actually communicate about it and build up a, um, yeah, practice a healthy practice and actually think through it. And, uh, that can really make all the difference in the world over time instead of getting bitter and resentful because you haven't communicated about certain things and you're just not doing it well or, or, you know, in a way that you're wasting much time or mm -hmm. energy. And 